It's not a bad level, it just needs a few changes. Is it telling me that it's gonna drop me into the spikes? It it did, but I thought it was gonna drop me much higher than that. I was not ready for that at all. I'm looking at this one like it's trying to tell me something, but it didn't show me exactly where the door was at. And that made it so much harder to read and it's unclear, so I'm gonna move on. concept. Why did they put the N64 music on there? Makes no sense. I swear to god if you kill me here, I'm gonna boo it. Okay. I was like, what is this? Did she just find all the sound effects in the game and thought, yeah, this is a good idea, let's do it. Is there actually going to be any Kaizos? I don't know if there's going to be any Kaizos. Okay, this is getting the boo. Thank God it was in the pit. Oh, it's a dropper section. Lovely. I think I'm dead. Yeah, that's a boo. I gotta go to the right, apparently, so let's play it again. Gross garbage. I don't think there are Kaisas, but this kind of design, you think there would be some, right? That makes more sense, honestly. I'm oh, sorry, not N64 music, it was a SNES music. I didn't see the logo, right? Oops. I'm gonna assume there's no kites. I searched for some and didn't find any. I'm gonna just go for it. How to be annoying in Mario Maker 101, sound effect spam. Nintendo, why are we allowed to do that? See, that jump is possible, that's what scared me. I'm dead again. I didn't, I didn't have enough speed. Wow, you need so much speed there. How long was it again? That was like the whole level, wasn't it? Yeah, that's that's the last bit of the level. There might be a hidden shroom somewhere. But once you know the solution, you don't really need the hidden shroom all that much. And there's not, there's not more than 10 coins in this level, so... Might have to be a skip here soon.
Joke's on you, level creator. I already know what sound effect spam is like, so I can easily see through your garbage. There might be a hidden shroom somewhere. I don't know where, though. I don't know where it would be. Probably, well, it could be here. Very possible there's a hidden shroom. Just chilling somewhere. We would make that section super free. Are we done? Not quite. Just in case. There we go. There's a checkpoint? What? Is there cheese in the slow that makes it only a minute long? Unfortunate for me. Unless the flag is right here and the checkpoint was just a useless uh, area. hell is this? Oh, I can't trust that. You know that. I have, wait. One minute and 30 tells me that you can actually make that jump. I'm gonna have to trust the pipe though. I hate the fact that I have to. There's more levels surprisingly. Someone really wanted to speedrun this level, I'm surprised, because this level's not that fun. And they use ice to try to kill the player, too. Mm. Alright, fine, we'll trust you. Watch that one. Dude, that was a soft walk. Okay. Wait, I know where I Well, now I know... <laughs> I know where I'm at! <laughs> uh, it's the left side. What?! Really? He's on the left side? That's so lame. I should just pause and start over, dude. I... Wow! Amazing! The checkpoint was useless! No wonder why this level was uh, free. You know what? That explains because the dropper section feels like something the creator couldn't have done. And that makes a lot, a lot of sense now. They just drop down there. Like, why wouldn't you? You know your level's so damn cheesable. There's no reason to play it. I'm just... How is this in Super Expert is my question. It's already cleared in since Super Expert. When I saw that burner in the top of the screen, I was like, wait a minute, I know where I'm at. Wow, imagine having pick a path in your level. I wonder where that door went. Well deserved, boo. What does that mean? Mini two. I mean, 
Oh, the, the okay, hold on. I wasn't really gonna play this, but that's a Kaiser line. <laughs> Not only do I have to make the trump, but I have to twirl and make sure I get oh, that is so gross. You get the twirl literally after making the trump trump or you die by with the Kaiser line. I guess technically you could stay within the area and be fine. Like, you could wall jump back up, but it'd be super risky and really dangerous to do so, but... I think they try to make a level here with the aesthetic choice, but I'm not sure. Am I playing a getting over it level? Secretly? I bet you there's a door behind those launchers. Why is there one way there? Do you not want me to play your level or something? I guess there isn't a door behind those launchers. Seemed like there would be a door. Hmm. I think you could cheese that. Hold on. I don't know if that's a shortcut or not, or intent. I think it's a shortcut. Wow, I really wanted to do that during burner timers. That'd be really fun, you know. I have a really great idea. Let's uh, put really annoying on-off sections with burner timers. It's brilliant. Nobody can uh, deny that. Why is there a random blooper in this level? Come on. Come on over here. Come on. Each up on you. No, I tried. I didn't want to die to the blooper RNG, so I decided against doing something really stupid. This really is a getting over a level, isn't it? It's some danger behind it. It's not free. Well, I guess technically it's free a little bit. I just want to make it more difficult. I think the single... The oh, fuck? Why? I think the, uh, the blooper idea is kind of meh. But other than that, it's not a bad level. Oh, gee, what? How come every time I compliment the level, I get this garbage? <laughs> Why? This level has a heavy emphasis on- Oh sh- Oh shit is exactly what I was gonna say. <laughs> heavy emphasis on uh, platform momentum and I don't like that. Cause this is like- This, this is the reason why this isn't super expert. God dang, do I really want that? Mm, yeah, it'd be easier than timing the one up over there. Gets the one up anyways. Did that level have a checkpoint? It had one, didn't it? Cause that level needed two checkpoints. I don't even know if it had one. I wasn't really paying attention. I think it did. Even if it didn't, it still needed two. No, I, that's the end right there, and I did so well. God, I did that so well. It could have, could have been a one-shot. You're not supposed to duck there, apparently.
You can go over the level. I couldn't... Oh, there's the end. I couldn't twirl over that. Uh, give me a second here. Let me take a look. See if it's even worth playing again. Because I, I know how to do it on the next try. I want to know how I do this part, though. Because that's the most confusing. Right here. I couldn't twirl. I actually did press the Z button. That's weird. I did everything correctly. I just couldn't twirl. Oh, maybe because the munchers? Yeah, maybe it's the munchers why I couldn't twirl there. All right, we'll do it one more time and we move on. It was no CP? Okay. That level definitely needed at least one CP. Minimum. Two recommended. Of the previous level before this, I mean. I couldn't- I literally am pressing Z and I can't- Okay, I'm out. I literally cannot twirl there. And I think it's because of the munchers and where they're placed. <laughs> I couldn't twirl again. Oh, nice troll. Troll or difficult? No, it's a troll. There's no difficulty in that factor. The only difficulty being mind games. Need more hashtag DGI? No. Further levels are questionable. They tend to be good, but we'll see. Why is that fast and not a slow conveyor? I don't know if it's worth it. It is pretty fun, though, I'll give it that. I... How was I supposed to know there was a track down there? I'm not gonna look to the right. How many more clears? Zom? Take a look at the Discord. Actually, take a look at the prediction. That might help you more. At least it's got good indicators. Everything's a little extended. At least there's no trolls. Okay, I think I get it. Oh, he just that's pretty cool i didn't expect him to turn around though i was aiming for him being fast and that's why i died he didn't do it this time what boom boom why didn't you do that because that almost got me killed again why is there a smiley face? Okay, get me out of here. <laughs> it was worth playing. I got some lives back. Uh, the horizontal two coins usually means hit in the middle. A vertical coin stack means twice. This is really hard. Moving on. I'm pretty sure those are min maxi dark jump twirls in a one gap situation. I think three is the max you can do. This is a troll. Why do you have turn blocks here?
Oh my god, they just did the thing we were not supposed to do in a, in a level like this. God damn it. You don't put a coop. You need a mole there. You need a mole. Or just a regular buzzy. Oh, wait, wait. I, I think I know why the turn blocks are there. It's supposed to be where you jump. What? 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 All right, we, we we're out of here. We're done. We're done. We are done. No more. We out. I don't even know what that was. I think it was the whole right situation, but they didn't give me a whole bridge. I already lost. I might as well just get out of here. What the fuck? <laughs> no, I, I didn't mean to do that. No, 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 let's not die here. <laughs> oh, this is a level for sure. You know what? Probably be better just to do this. I think it'd be more. Yeah, I think it's just safer. Oh, look at this guy. I think she's really cool coming down over here. I think they want me to go up there, and I know how to cheese it. But I want to see if these guys have a key. Okay, they do. Not like it matters that much. Okay, I'm gonna try to go in that sword pipe, and then if I can't go in there, I have an idea to keep my link. I really didn't even damage Iggy at all, interesting. Alright, here's my idea. If it does, if it's not enterable, good. I have a brilliant idea. Just can't mess this up or I'm screwed. Pretty sure that's the only way to win this level, if that's the last bit. Never mind. Didn't matter. Um, they want me to do that thing, but. But I can just do this, so... Now I just need one. Okay. Can't keep a link. Even if I would've spammed jump, it wouldn't have mattered, so... Is there a link up here by chance? No. They didn't even bother covering it up. I can enter that muncher pipe, but I don't think it's required. Oh my god. Why? Why? How do I... How do I avoid that without Link? Can I really not just jump out of that door and be okay with the Link? I think I could, right? In theory. Who had my uh, key, by the way? Was it... Was it Ludwig? Is it Roy? I don't remember. I don't know why I didn't do it this way. I guess I could do it this way too. 
I think it was Ludwig. I can't be certain. Could have been Roy. It was, it was Ludwig, okay. Uh, no, I still want to keep my Link Star. I think that's cheese. And I can bypass the uh, Goomba section. Okay, he's gone. He's just gonna disappear. Why are you in there? Why are you in there? Get out. Okay. There might be a way to cheese this. If I can get a link, an extra link sword again, that would be like big brain, you know? I'm gonna spam jump out of that door. Hopefully, that doesn't get me killed. This is actually huge. Hold on. Um, I think. Yes! Yes! Holy shit, let's go. You're not supposed to have Link. Yeah, it is great. I was hoping to make one-ups off of that. Oh, well. Instead of making one-up... Oh, I can. Wait. Where the fuck is the extra link, then? Oh, we gotta go in that pipe, but I just cheesed the whole level, so see ya. There is no way the creator knew how to do that. If that was required, that's insane. I don't think it was, though, because the door onto the Link Sword didn't make any sense. But then again, some creators are pretty crafty in their garbage. What did I just say? Do not small? Do not get small? <sighs> don't take damage, I think it meant, right? Right? Is that what you meant? Why is there a in here? Don't take damage. Please shoot. Okay. I think I was supposed to grab that midair. Fuck me. I should be troll. It's not a troll. Okay, I have to actually grab that midair. Well, that's that's just lame. That's a lame mechanic in your level. There's no way for me to grab this without that. Wait, I have to take damage. No, the Goomba at the beginning! Uh, what happened to the Goomba at the beginning? Hello? I need that pow- Oh, uh, well, I know the answer, at least. I got three one-ups, so... I don't think I can even get this. Yeah, okay. Wait. Yeah, the key door goes straight to the- Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. I, I actually got the answer here. I need that Goomba at the beginning. I need to grab that pow immediately. How do we get the Goomba to come towards us? How? Why? I mean, now I still have- I get the Goomba, I think. I think it'll respawn, it's not a big deal. Wait, how do I- How do I get the power then? How do I get the pal? I just have to trust my instincts and go for it? What? I need the pal to drop in that little box to get the key. How the fuck do I get... There's, there's some hidden garbage. 
Because you can't, there's no way you can grab it from here. If you let that shoot, it's not gonna work out. See? I can't grab that. Without taking damage. Is there a mushroom in there? No, I don't hear, I didn't hear a mushroom. Ow. Whatever the pal has to bounce off the Goomba? I ha- Shit, I think you're right. Wait, no, that can't be right, because I still need the pal to, to get the Goomba over there. No, never mind, you're not right. That would be a good idea, though, if there was a requirement. There's something hidden in this level. Some hidden, like, tech or something. An item. There are many things in this level. You might be able to jump and carry this pal at the same time. Very possible. Maybe? I feel like there's a hidden pal. Because I don't know how you're supposed to actually get that. Yeah, you might be able to get the power off the ground, but that doesn't matter that much. Yeah, I didn't think you were the answer. There might be a way to grab it midair. But I don't know how to do it. Hmm. I'm gonna skip it. Pretty garbage level. There might be a hidden power at the beginning of the level somewhere. Is it possible that level gave you a mushroom at the end? And it was just a troll? I want to go check real quick. Because that would make a lot of sense. If that was just all haha, get trolled, you know, situation. But the title says do not small, so... Let me check something real quick. Just, it's possible there's a, there's a random mushroom at the end of the level. I mean, Roy has got to be my favorite. I mean, Wendy is, uh, Team Donut's mascot, so I can't argue with that. Shit. Shoot, 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 shoot. Come on, shoot. It's very possible there's a mushroom at the end, or maybe in the stack still. No. The world record states that there could be a mushroom at the end of this. There isn't. How the fuck do you do this? I'm so confused. How do you get that pal off the ground? Uh, it might be a speedrun thing. That's the only thing I can think of. Like you just run and it's like ready to go. You know what I mean? Like that. And you just, you're already ready, and then you just go like this and grab it. If it's really that, it's a boo-worthy puzzle. Thought maybe that might have been the answer. Maybe less speed? I think you need speed there. I'm pretty damn sure you need speed. Let's hold on. Let me look in the spike area. Hmm, didn't see any Kaizos. No hidden mushrooms in the Kaizo area. Is it really that? That's so stupid. I'm gonna hit it with the hard boot because it's just some garbage puzzle tech. I don't want to see it again. I'm pretty sure it's just a speed-related attack, and it's just garbage. Hey, to go. A 
puzzles should not require insane amount of attack. If a puzzle requires very tight tech, then it's not a puzzle to me. Just hot garbo. Why does this look like Luna's level? Also, that's a bit blind. It only shoots one power, Maya. And once that's gone, you can't deload it. Hi? What is this level? Is this like Luna's level? But worse. <laughs> I didn't even see that clock because I wasn't looking over earlier. Crap. Why? Ew. Ew. Everything is just so blind and extended. Your worst nightmare on crack. How did I survive that? I thought I was dead. I'll take it though. Oh, Flango, was it really just an edge jump to get that? Was it really just an edge jump full speed? Okay, let me take a look then. Hold on. I'll leave that as a neutral. It's okay. So it's basically hard tag. It's a precision technique. What they should have done is put the cloud in front so it would have been fine. Still worthy of a boo for puzzle concept. You don't even mark your hidden kaizos. The translation of do not get small is kind of meh. You know? Shit. And like, I have to do this like really quickly or I'm screwed. Wow. Look how much speed you need. I, like, do I have to commit to it? I'm so confused. How much speed do you need? What? Why is that a... Th why? 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 Why require that? Puzzles should not be this complicated. I tr I didn't even grab it anyways. Oh, <laughs> minard. What's the best way to get that power then? I think you do want the the mushroom there. But I could be wrong. Oh! No, you don't want the mushroom so that way you can get back on the cloud. Is that the puzzle? That's kind of gross. So, I think you're supposed to go full speed without the mushroom. That was the intention of that section. Even if you do get full speed, I don't know if you can actually get back on. Let me see. You can! That's, that's so gross. If you're not small, you can't make that. Because having big, you hit the ceiling. What a dumb puzzle concept. Like, I understand the guiding of the Goomba, I get that, but don't... It's such an awkward position for that. Just don't make the uh, POW so difficult to get. You only get one chance, basically. And if you don't do an edge jump there, you don't get it. You did it big? Maybe you did a re-grab jump? Or maybe you backed off when you had too much speed? I think the intention was to be small. It's so hard to get. I could let the Goomba despawn, that is very true. That would make my life a little bit easier. But the fact that I have to edge jump here is pretty garbo. The cloud is probably only there to save you when you do the big jump. You only get one chance, I'm pretty sure, with the uh, puzzle lineup.
It's possible you did re-grab. But if you turned around early, then you didn't. Oh, shit. That worked out really well. I might actually need P-Speed here. No, this is not me trying to clear the level badly. This is me just trying to clear the level in general. This to prove a point why it's a bad puzzle concept. I think I want speed here. I think this is what you're supposed to do. But I'm not sure. I'm gonna just let the... I don't think I'm gonna get world record. So I just need to let the Goomba despawn, and I'll let it respawn later. That's all I'll do. It'll be easier in general. Wow, I just can't get it, dude. This is such a hard jump. It has to be pixel perfect. Oh, I got it. Okay, 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 okay. Uh, grab mushroom. Could have a world record here, damn. Grab, uh, we just wait, we just wait now. Should have been respawned. Okay, good. This should be it. No, you don't really need P-Speed. It does help you, though. There you go. That's how you beat the level. Probably could have gotten more record though. That's okay. Yeah, dude, I think that was a pixel perfect jump from the spikes area to grab that. Like, I didn't even know that was possible until Lango told me. Do I have to jump? It's trying to make me. No, you don't have to jump. You just gotta hold jump here. Why? I tried to press down for it. Not like I really wanted to play it anyways. I'm used to edge jumps, Zeke's. But sometimes I'm so afraid to even do the thing and jump. This is a reclaim. How short is it? 36 seconds. Oh, I tried. You have to get a reclaim there. Uh, kind of want to get my Kaizo on today. I don't think I played a real Kaizo level today. I'm gonna be honest. It's been a while since I've done some shell jumps. I think that was a one percent clear rate, if I'm not mistaken, or like a point eight, point nine. And I died to the spike. Fair enough. Can't see. Oh yeah, I like thanks for marking it with the, the mushroom platform. Really was useful there. <laughs> That's really awkward. Was there a reason why I had to be so low? Kind of wish there wasn't a clear condition in this level and just red coins instead. It's kind of in the face at the beginning, you know? I thought I was playing a Kaizo shell level. What happened to that? Uh, 
hold on. Hold on. I saw something, but I don't know where it was. This level is really blind for Kaizo. I can't see it. Okay, it's to the, slightly to the right of it, of that semi-solid. Okay. Still miss it anyway, because it's just so freaking far down. They gave up. They get, dude, this level creator is like, man, I don't mind blind falls. Let's just throw a whole bunch in. <laughs> they really, there's no need for the blind falls. There really need, has no need for it. If they had a coin trail, maybe it would be easier than the semi solids, but or the mushroom blocks. Sorry. This part is kind of like unneeded too. It doesn't really need to be in the level, but okay. the whole level oh I see imagine that was a spike wall I'm glad I didn't play this in endless though but it ate so many lives well Barry I prefer they at least mark something with their stuff. But with <laughs> when you're in blind fall or semi blind fall because they have mushroom indicators is like a whole freaking screen. Maybe you should just back off from that. You know, there's no need to have it so far down. It was, they were just too lazy to, uh, to fix that problem. I think I'm already dead, but whatever. Oh, you have death pipes. I should have saw one, that one coming. I don't know why I went in there. I shouldn't have. I saw where the pipe uh, led. I think that's a midair shell at the end. This will be my last chance on it then. Oh, I already messed up. I think I'm dead. I think I should have uh, grabbed behind it there. Oh, that was it too, damn it. I was like pixels from it. I'm just gonna skip it. I tested death confirmed. Yes, exactly. <laughs> I had that midair. Hmm. They use aesthetic choices here. Don't know if that's a good or oh. Uh, I have some light sources, so I'm like, okay to play it. You know, these tracks make me believe I'm going to be chased on the way back. Just a hunch I have. Like he knew. Oh, then we're fine. We're fine. I thought I was gonna come and block me off. Oh, there's a checkpoint here. Uh, hold left, I guess. I could just duck under him. I don't see the issue. Oh, it gets in front of the door. I see the issue. I have to. I hate the fact that I have to do it this way. This is not fun. I have to pause buffer if I want to do this first try, and that's really stupid. This is why you shouldn't do dark levels, confirmed. I think I can just run, right? Yeah. Okay, now we got a, like a red coin situation, or just don't die? Okay, don't die situation. 
And he dies. And I should not go that. I should probably go later. <laughs> I shouldn't do that, that too quickly. I, I died. Um, unfortunately. Anyways. And it has to be dark, which is the worst thing here. The fact that this is so dark, you know? I don't even remember where these blocks are because it's... Oh. See? Yeah, that's fine. Uh, we stay still, wait for them to go across, and then we go. See, this section I think is fair. In all honesty, I think this section is really fair. As you can see, there's no problem with it. Oh, what is this garbage? Why is there a track on the way back? Oh, they're trying to kill me, I see. That is dumb. We're fine. Yeah, some mistakes are allowed, but not, not very many. Can I stream often then yet? Not sure how English that was, but I'm gonna try to stream more if possible. Probably should have booted because it used dark in a bad way. But I see what they were going for. I mean. <laughs> You're not gonna punish me for cheesing, are you? I mean, it's in the damn title, dude. <laughs> okay, they know what they're doing. I mean, I think that's possible to make. I'm not even joking. Oh, I love this cheese so much. Let's go. I shouldn't have grabbed that. Because it would have been better just to cheese it. That's a Kaiser line, isn't it? Is there any cheese here? No, I don't think so. Wait, can I just... No, I can't shove... Uh, this is actually real. I don't think you can cheese this. Wait. Yes, you can. But the question is, does the bomb matter? Duh. Wait, no it doesn't! Because I have the spike mitt. Oh shit. Huh, so much for freaking cheese. I might start this over? You only get one chance at that though, never mind. I'm just gonna move on. Very interesting concept, but done wrong. Exclamation point ranks. Dark level. Nah, I'm good. Don't kill me out of the store, please. Oh, I had a chance to win. Fuck you. Don't, don't, just don't put doors on the side of the walls, please. I had a feeling it was going to do that in a wall jump level like that. No, bad. 
I don't even know if I could do it on the next try because that's a very hard wall jump to do. Guess we're gonna find out. Hold left, immediately jump. Oh, they make it so awkward, dude. Come on. I could do it on the next try, though. Oh, I could have been second place long ago. I just had some problems during the summer. I was getting 75 clears a day. Trust me, I could have done it. But third place wanted second place for a little bit for the tuxedo, so I decided, you know what? It's not worth doing it off stream. I didn't want to. He was sweating too. I felt bad. I was expecting a flop, I'm not even gonna lie. It just felt like it. Why? Oh, what? I thought I turned around, but I kept pressing left for some reason. God damn it, Roy, what the hell are you doing? It's the music, I tell you. So I just don't have a quiet taste for it, apparently. Oh, I almost died there. Seriously, it shouldn't have died there. I'm gonna die here, though. <laughs> what did I just say? What did I just fucking say? <laughs> This level creator sucks. Also, I need to double check on that wall jump. Hold on. I don't want to mess this up again. Give me a second. Give me one second. I want to confirm what I just saw. Yeah, it's just a regular wall jump. Okay. This level would have not eaten so many lives if they didn't have bad door entries. This level looks so innocent, too, because of the tech required to win. I'm starting to think that this person doesn't know how to use twirls. I don't know why. And again, you can't get past that three without twirling anyways, so... Mm. Holding left, jumping. There we go. Oh yeah, they were 10 hour streams. I, I, can, I can go back to those, but I need to start making more YouTube content. This is a uh, Defender fake account, it looks like. But I could be wrong. Maybe that's not the intent. The fuck? Well, they at least outline, so I cannot be that mad. I mean, rip bit rate, but at least I know what I'm looking at. That's a hard turnaround, you know? Yeah, I saw that earlier. Trying to hit me with the debate. Okay, well, I just don't know where I'm going now, apparently. I guess that fire flower is fake. Good to know. Hmm. You can jump at the end. I don't know if that's a good idea, though. Definitely not a good idea. There is a vine there. You see that vine? Is that a sneaky cheeky vine? Oh, well fuck you too. Why are you going that way? Why? 
No, I would have lost my clear condition here unless. I'm kind of willing to play this level again. I need to test something though. I think it, wait, if I go through that pipe, I might die. Probably won't though. I'm all three cool, uh, three one-ups. I, I need to practice this section if it lets me. If it kills me, I move on probably. Okay, we're good. Good, we're fine. I need to practice this section, so let's just do that. Touch it right away. The reason why I touched it right away, the snake block, is to test the burner cycle because it's a global, uh, you know, global thing. It's always loaded. So I wanted to see if I do this right now, that do I die for it or do I need to time it? You could just do that, but that's not fair. I need to wait half a second, I think, before going on the snake block if I want to time it better. Gotta hold right there. It's a dumb level, but it might be worth playing in Endless. On the edge, gotta follow the snake block at the top. It's gonna go up now? No. It's gonna go down. And it's gonna go up and... Or not so much immediately, apparently. Uh, this is not cool. This is just bullshit. I hate it when snake blocks go up on a don't jump level. They're just, it's just, why? It's just dumb. Also, why are there vines here? I need to test these vines, I think. You can just follow these, right? Can you follow down here. This is just a waste of time. And it stops right on the thing, okay. We go through here and see what happens. That's the end. I didn't get the test to see if that other part was the end, too. Dang it. Is that jump possible? Hold on, is that jump actually possible? No, that jump is bait. I don't think that jump is possible because of how extended that it is. It's not possible. That's just bait. Okay. You can't touch a spring quite. It's a don't don't put foot level. You touch a spring, you lose your put foot. Yeah, if it wasn't a put uh, don't put foot level, I think it, it would definitely be cheesable. The fire flowers are bait, too. I don't know why they're there. Yeah, it counts as ground. Correct. Kind of wish it didn't, because technically you're not on the ground, but there would be more spring levels, too. It'd be kind of cool. Why is there a spring anyways? There's no use for it. I should be- I forgot again, are you serious? God damn! That is such an evil snake block. <laughs> that is just, that is the most evil snake block in this level. I forgot again that it went the other way. It's been so long since I've been there. That it just was out of my mind. Okay, I gotta remember, wait half a second and then let the snake block do its job.
It almost makes me want to do that jump, though. To get to the end. Just for shits and giggles. Yeah, oh, fuck it. Get me out of here. I'm done. I forgot how fast it went. You literally have to barely touch and then go to the left. That's just... They should have had a wall there instead. I wanted to play something more fun. Like this, for example. This is definitely fun, you know? Not garbage or anything. Here, good level design. No cap. Well, can I please? I'm playing it again, by the way, because I think it's worth it. I need to get on top of the icicles and I win, I think. How do I not take damage here? Hmm. I guess I just have to get on the icicle? Right? There's no secret, is there? I don't think so. This will be the last attempt I move on. I could take my t uh, time to kill it. I could. But... Well, I'm screwed now. I don't think there's any way to avoid damage here. I'm just gonna skip. I think it's worth it. Just get up. Well, I get the plus three if I would have cleared it, but I'm just gonna get sucked into a level like that. What do you want me to test tell? If the spring drop counts as no put foot, I can guarantee you it counts as put foot. You're gonna lose the ground if you touch the spring. Guaranteed. I know from experience. Ah yes, the Galoomba Tower. At least that was kind of like a cute version. I thought it was gonna be like heavy garbage, but... After the last two levels, I feel like this is such a good change of pace. Where's my buzzies, though? Okay. Of course, I'd be at 99. Fast or slow? Fast. I didn't grab the vine because the level told me not to. Really? Well, at least I had a mushroom, I guess. Oh, why is that one hittable? That's weird. There's a coin on top of you. I don't think I want it, though. I don't need that Goomba. I don't know. There was something over here I saw. Hold on. I want to see what it is first. Oh, it's just a, just a ground block. Never trust Goombas. They're RNG. Oh, you're talking. About, I think what Tao was talking about was. Was that jump possible? I don't think it is in the previous level. That that big ass jump. Can you not put a blind jump after all this in a clear condition level? That'd be great. What? What is the indicator? Am I missing? Hold on. 
Was there like something midair that I just missed? Oh, just a hidden item. I'm glad I got that. I was about to kill myself. I legitimately was gonna go do a big jump for no reason whatsoever. This is where all my buzzies are at. I lose my cape, it's GG's. Oh, not really. I could just have done that. Okay, I don't know where my last one is. It might have gone off screen already. Could be in here. Nope. Uh, oh, there it is. There he is. Uh, there we go. That's all of them, right? Okay, yeah, you just only need three. The only reason why I was looking at this is because I don't know if it was all or just some. God, this level's too long for a clear condition level. Actually, I probably could have flown there. Oh well. It has too many one-ups. It's trying to like play nice with me, but I got a time limit to worry about. Why is there an on off there? Doesn't matter. Cool. And then the clear condition is unwarranted. His level's too long. It's too long without a checkpoint. The clear condition is completely pointless. The three buzzies there could have just been aesthetic enemy design. And instead, they just decided to put clear conditions so they have an excuse for no checkpoints. There needed to be a checkpoint right where the cape was at. Also, hidden cape, by the way. Hidden cape is the one of the reasons why I boot it. You shouldn't have a hidden item that's required to beat anything you're level. What the hell is this garbage? Okay. I need a P-switch. I think I'm dead. Nope, but I also cheesed it, so that's nice. Let's go. Literally don't know where to go. In a level that requires you to go fast, you can't do that. Really unfair. Oh, I didn't. I thought I was gonna wall jump there, not. Oh my god, I think that was frame perfect. Uh, okay. I'm just gonna reset. I see no reason not to. Well, in a level that requires you to go up, you can't just put something super blind like that in the level. It's, it's bullshit. Uh, why is there a pipe here? Okay, you don't go that way. Good. Also, hi, Toyo. That probably was a soft walk, I'm gonna be honest. If they know how to use the one Kaizo, they know how to soft walk somebody. Nice. I think that was a plus one, barely. I am gonna boot this level, though. That was a very hostile, uh, you know, Kaizo inside a level that requires you to go fast with no knowledge prior. It was a good concept, but done poorly. Very, very poorly.
What am I playing? Do I want to go in here? That's the flag. That's actually good information. That's the flag pole. So that means the pipe is probably where I should be going. Maybe? I need a mushroom here. Wait, there's a door. Where's that door? I think that jump is possible. I don't think this is required, but... That jump, I think, is actually possible really hard, though. Oh, there's an on-off right here. Hmm. Then case it? Oh, yeah, for sure. Uh, I think I need the mushroom for something. In the previous room, I think that might have been cheese. Okay, this is just a survival room. That's all it is. Shouldn't be too bad. Survival rooms shouldn't be longer than like 20 seconds, maybe even 30 at most. That one felt like it was, eh, probably was 30. I feel like that was kind of boring though, honestly. Ah, uh, I see. Mm, can I go in this one? Probably. Let me try. Nope, no entry. Oh yeah, I've, I've been streaming on Twitch for quite some time. That's where I all started anyways, so... Told you it was possible, but there's probably just no reason for it. That mushroom might be required for that coop. Wait, where do I go then? Oh, this is a whole other section. I heard something disappear, so what I'm gonna do is actually reset. I don't want to accidentally be screwed. I knew it was something that was important. I'm gonna hit the piece switch on purpose and grab that coinage. Yeah, that way I can go back whenever I want. This is actually a pretty cool level. The survival is kind of meh, but aesthetic-wise, this is a pretty cool level. I don't think I needed him. Okay, I think this goes to the shell. No? It goes to a different pipe, okay. Well, I should go into it. I think I have to go further next time. This looks like a boss fight. Oh, I give you a measure, okay. This looks like a spider. Am I playing a Pikmin level? I think this is inspired by Pikmin. Oh, I shouldn't have done that, whatever. Doesn't matter. This level's inspired by Pikmin. I can tell. Because I played Pikmin. I know what that looks like. That spider is literally a Pikmin spider. If I'm not mistaken. I gotta go fast. Come on. I really don't need the P-Switch, so it ain't gonna matter. Yeah, this is literally like Pikmin-style stuff. And these are just like big ol' enemies. I had to jump over him. I don't got time. And everything is huge, like you're small. It makes, it just makes sense, honestly. No, 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 don't hit that on off. Where the hell do I? How do I? I need a P-Switch.
Come on. I need two piece switches. How? I need a mushroom? But where? I need a... <sighs> it, literally, it literally looks like a Pikmin level, yeah. I need a mushroom to beat this level. I hate... Oh, the P-Switch! But if I get a mushroom... All right, we're, we're gonna go here first. This is faster. This level should have had a 500 second timer. Okay, how do I steal a mushroom? Because that'd be very important. We're gonna go to the last section first. Because we know how to do the other ones pretty easily. Does this section give me a mushroom? Give me a one-up. Not one I was looking for, I'm gonna be honest. And there's nothing there that's important, okay. Let's just do this boss fight. I could, but here's the thing, going back up with that mushroom's like impossible, so. This is so dumb to get this. You shouldn't require that. I think one piece switch was good enough for this boss fight. Whatever. Okay, as long as I don't screw up the rest of the level, we should be okay. Can I go back? I could actually go back and check out some other stuff in the level. I think I'm gonna do that. Go look around. Oh, I could have just... Okay. What is all this? Don't For you real? dare... Don't you dare kill... Okay, this is the... Wait, this... Oh, you're... Thank you for the one ways. I actually really appreciate that. Truly appreciate that. Hey, Isaiah. It would actually be a nice 500 second level. Oh, right, the... I can go back, you're right. I could literally just take this mushroom back. That's a good point. This is the only room where you can take the mushroom back, I think. Get away with it. Wait, you can't take the mushroom with you. Because you have to be small no matter what. Taking back the mushroom... Here, I'll show you what I mean by that. Well, actually, no, I have to go through here to get my coins, so never mind. Yeah, never mind. You can't you can't take the mushroom back. It's just not a good idea. I should be making levels. Exclamation point maker idea. I have plenty of levels. What clear room are we on? I have no idea. You'll find out in just a moment. I'm pretty much on a like a really annoying timer here. Just in case I need to go back this way, I'm gonna unlock it now. I think with 500 second timer, I think I would have given this a like, even with the shitty survival section, which should only have been like 15 seconds at most. Ooh, I almost died there. Like, I like the Pikmin inspired level. I'm like a big fan of like this lore, but the design should have just been maybe an infinite red coin level instead. No, it wouldn't be the same because Pikmin was always about the, you know, the big little pellet things. <laughs> It just wouldn't be the same. Oh, I died because of the... Look at that. You can see the donut block literally just respawned. <laughs> I can't believe I died on that donut block. That's so lame. Let's just do everything in order. You can take the mushroom back here, though. I'm going to do that. Maybe. Let me see. Can I steal this mushroom for the final area? A moment. I don't think he can, unless I get the P-Switch. If I get the P-Switch, I can get out. Big brain, big freaking brain. I know how to make that final section super free. I know how to make that final, yeah, that, that third coin is super free. Get ready. As long as I don't lose the mushroom. I shouldn't, this boss fight's pretty easy. Or survival fight.
Let me go back here real quick. We wasted some time. That's okay. But we use this uh, piece switch timer to let us into the level. Oh, you you big brained me. I see how it is. I didn't I didn't see the P blocks there. Fuck me. God, I thought I was so clever. If I do this, oh, you're not even supposed to be. Whatever. If I go back through this way, can I do that? Or am I locked off? Ah, oh, man. Wait, P-Switch? No, P-Switch would just drop me there. And then, I think there are Kaizo... No, there can't be Kaizo lines there. If I take the P-Switch and go this route instead, and jump over that, would, I could steal the mushroom. You can also do this, apparently. Hold on. You can do this and get inside. I've seen a video of it. Almost had it. Maybe I can do it. I don't got much time, though. I should not be doing this. I almost had it, though. It was so good. Whatever. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna mess with that. I'd rather go back here and do this peace wish thing again. I have a big brain idea. Probably gonna die again for it, but I think this will work by like going backwards. And the unfortunate side is I have to do this 30 second survival section again. But if I speed run the rest of the level and do the final section first with the with the uh, spike ball launchers and the Hammer Bro, which is the most dangerous section without a mushroom for some reason. If I can do that first, I should be able to do everything else in 150 seconds. In theory. So that's the plan. I don't think I have enough time. I do. Wow, I actually have enough time. And I can- There we go! Right there! Jeez, let's go! Okay, now we gotta wait. Uh, it's gonna go off screen though, how do we... No, 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 we re re reset, 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 reset. Reset even bigger cheese, the biggest brainish cheese you've seen in a while. Done. That's the better cheese. And then we go back through here. We gotta do the survival section one more time. We can do it without the mushroom, though. The second one gives a mushroom as well, so it doesn't really matter. Uh, yeah, it's better just to do the survival section first and then go through the ending. I should have enough time to beat the level. Now see, this level is probably only a hot, probably two minute clear con level. Not really worthy of a boo. You know? I respect the uniqueness of this level, so I'm not gonna boo it. But the timer needs to be 500 seconds, it's just too lazy to not change it to that. Should have enough time. Alright, we're not gonna do this stupid. We're gonna take our time here. Well, not too much time anyways, because I have to go quickly. Do you want that mushroom so give me that? Should be fine. We don't need a mushroom anyways, because this section exists.
and we're done. Was it 24 seconds? I think it should have been 15 or less. It was kind of ugly that way. That's okay, though. I think this level could be much better with 500 seconds. And maybe the 50 coins are optional. And it's a red coin checkpoint level. It would have been so much better. I mean, they had a really cool concept. Don't get me wrong. It was Pikmin related. So I know they tried to make a level there. Doesn't mean it was good, though. Probably shouldn't even touch this level, honestly. Is that a middle finger or a dick, I wonder? Any mushrooms? Oh, that's the kiosk they were talking about, I see. Ah, oh, that was supposed to be a bigger jump. It's uncleared. It's garbage, by the way. It's, it's worthy of a boo. I wish it had a power-up. I know that door's gonna kill you. I don't know why I grabbed that. I'm surprised at that, honestly. That is a very surprising factor in this level. But I think this is the end. I think I might actually have to kill Bowser with this fire fire. No, I don't. It's, it's free. Let's go. Also, that door. Instant death, for sure. Why does it look so easy? I've played so many super expert levels that I'm just used to this garbage. I was expecting the fire flower to be required. Just to kill Bowser out of the way or something. Maybe hit a bomb or something. Hmm, I don't think this is... This is... This is not worth it, right? If I were to grab one of those spray... Hold on. The red coins might be required, but I can't grab the springs. And triple jump either. I can get inside the different areas. I'm just gonna take. I'm gonna look into this. Hold on. I want to see if the red coins are required. They might be required. Not sure. The key door is up there. Huh. This is such an ugly level, I, and that's probably pick a path. I'm moving on. It does have the best music, that's true. I've never played this level, and I just saw this on Ryu's last... Uh... We have to at least try it, right? I have no idea what this level is capable of, so just be aware if uh, if I fail this and I have to skip it. Why is there a Bowser? Why is there a Bowser? I guess for this? I'm gonna go this. Uh, he probably put a troll if I go too far, right? Oh, there's a little nifty. Uh... Hold on. I don't wanna get stuck over here. Level seems kinda nice for a Ryu level, I'm not gonna lie. There's a checkpoint! I might have to play this! I have to kill him, apparently. Oh, I didn't even see that. Uh-oh, I'm dead. I'm pretty- Oh my god, that was bullshit design. Shame on you, Ryu. <laughs> Why did- Why did you set it up like this, man?
If you're unfamiliar with Ryu, this is a Ryu car level that he probably recently made. I'm only playing it because I got lucky to checkpoint, honestly. As long as you don't need it at the end, I'm cool. Please? Thank you. Please don't need Acorn. Please don't force it. If you force Acorn, I'm going to be a little upset. Okay, you didn't force it. Oh, shit. Don't die. But if you had it, you would got one ups, and that's okay. The fact that I beat a Ryu card level in Endless, though. At least, what, on the second try? Yeah, barely. It's not worthy of a boo. It's not. I think the beginning was alright. The boss fight was a little sketch. But the, the level was fine. I'm not going fast here. I would rather take my time. Garbage. Uh, it's kind of worth playing though. I don't know if you'll die to that thwomp if you don't jump. I don't think you. It seems like you can just run through here, so I'm gonna do that. Mm, I gotta do that right away. Okay, last try. Kind of blind, but it's fine. They have coins, so I guess I'm not that upset. Could have died there. If that would have had a, a parachute on it, I would have been really mad and upset. Uh, what was that hitbox? I'm dead. I'm dead for that hitbox. Yeah, nah, it's not worth it. My character went in between the thwomp and somehow survived. That's what happened. Wow, you got me good with that one. I couldn't even see those potaboos. I'm booing it for the spam. This, this level's already bad. That's why I booed it. Nope. I think they went up some. Wait, does that pipe literally go to the end? Why wouldn't I just go in it then? Why would I go in that troll pipe? You're not forcing me to do that. Get me out of here. And the bottom pipe just straight up kills you. Wow. You would have to be some kind of dumb to not go into the next clear pipe to win. Like, that one was just so obvious it wasn't even funny. Oh, 3D world after 3D world after 3D world, huh? Alright. Kind of blind. Um. 
Do I need a hint then? Why? Why why would I ever do that? There's no reason for me to throw that shell in there. Yeah, thank you for the clip, by the way. That was a weird hitbox on the thwomp. Poo poo jump. Yes. I mean, it doesn't look that poop. Seen worse. He says as he dies instantly to. It is poo poo though. Don't get me wrong. I think it's like an instant pullback. Wow, that really is a shitty jump. I thought maybe I could control it, but all right, we're gonna take this one out of endless. I don't want to lose too many lives on this poo poo jump. I want to actually figure this out. I think it's it's either one of two things. The very minimal effort Z jump on a thwomp hold left really hard. Or it's the hold right really hard Z jump pull back immediately. I think it's the first one. The first suggestion I had. Very, very specific pullback. I think it's that. I don't I don't think it's a I don't think it's full. Because if it's full, I think you just die, right? Yeah, you just die. It's too high up. If it was one below, it wouldn't be that. So let's just get close to the spike as much as possible. And then just get a really sh shitty hitbox. And I bet you there's one more at the end of this level. So it wouldn't be a shitty jump if, if he didn't include it twice. You know what I mean? You pulled an amaretto. Oh, damn, that sucks. Man, that is a hard jump. <coughs> Excuse me. They weren't getting one with poo poo. Wait, what if I just did? Oh, it's not high enough. I can't line up with the ball. Oh, that is so hard to do. I don't think there's a dead block. This this seems like a real jump. I think you might have to line up with the spike to make this even worthwhile. You know what I mean? Like, get super close to the spike and then Z and pull back. God, it's so hard. I don't think it's pixel perfect. I think it's very close to being so, though. God, it's so hard. <laughs> I gotta get like a really good Z jump off of the thwomp. What if I have to get like a... Hold on, I have an idea. Yes, that's what I was thinking. There we go. I figured it out. That's a hard move for me, buddy. I'm sorry, but that's garbage. You have to hit the, like, okay, so you know how the Thwomp has, like, a top hitbox and, like, a, a middle hitbox? I'm aiming for the middle hitbox, and that's exactly how I'm doing this. I'm aiming for that middle hitbox. If I can aim for that, I'm fine, because I'm lower. You know what I mean? So, if I aim for that hitbox, I should be fine. Come on, just go for it. You're lower, so it shouldn't kill you. There we go. I might have to go up there. The thwomp is back. Does that mean I have to go for a Z jump on the thwomp? Can you survive that? No, I think you have to go up there and get a mushroom. I think there's a mushroom up there. Pretty clever spin jump requirement. To go for like a the middle hitbox of the thwomp. So you don't die, but you still spin jump off of it. And the funny thing is we just experienced that hitbox in the previous level with the thwomp that I got a weird hitbox. Come on, just hit it. 
It's a clever garbage ju uh, jump, yeah. Very clever. I can get that hitbox. I wouldn't have booed it if it was just for the one jump. Like, the fact that it's more than just one, this, this one jump is making it even more garbage than it needs to be. It's still pretty hard. I have to hit that specific hitbox, which is actually really big. You think about it. That would have been the hitbox if I would have touched the thwomp. My, my lives will never run out. Because once I get to a certain point, I can just turtle and just get lives back. But playing garbage levels that don't have too much garbage to kill you, just really boring level design. Basically, play long levels, get plus three is what I'm saying. If I have to do it that way. Come on, can I just get this jump one more time? I got it twice in a row. <laughs> Dies of the freaking spike. <sighs> that was the hitbox too, and I missed it. At least the height. Come on. I have to pull back really quickly though, otherwise I still die. Too high. <sighs> I really wish I would have checked up there instead and just cleared the level instead. Too far to the right. I collab with little curves. I don't think he has any interest in me. Close. That should have been it. Too early. If I hit that hitbox too early, I just die. I think I need to like just go into it. Otherwise, I'll just hit the icicle anyways. I need to like pull back immediately. I need to hit the right hitbox and pull back. Like that! That's exactly what I was just thinking. Just immediately hit the hitbox and pull back. Hi, Sep. I'm almost about this close to just say fuck it and move on. I did 20 people like this almost. Uh, 19, right? 19, yeah. That's why hitbox should not exist. God, the fact that I got it twice in a row though, when I first tried it. When I first thought of like the tech requirement, and now I just can't get it. That could be it too. It could just be like a hard whole back. Like this. It really could just be that, honestly. But the way that I did it was pretty good too. You at least put a checkpoint after it? Yeah, that's true. I agree with that. Oh, maybe a re-grab with the... The Z-Jump might work? Nah, that's too much speed. I can't do that. For the accurate title? Yeah, maybe it was for the title that they liked it for. That's probably what it was. I think you're right. Reminds you of Anga's video? I don't think he had this hard garbage in it. Could be wrong though. I need to do a re-grab Z-Jump probably. I really think I need to do that. Just 
commit to it. I think that was it. It was super close. If it isn't team, uh, team precision, it gets likes for- that's true, that's kind of lame if that's the case. That also should have been the hitbox, but the lost hitboxes are like three pixels inside. So it's lame. That should have been it as well. I had it. All right, I'm done with this level. Too much, too much time wasted on the garbage. I do want to see one thing though. Is the mushroom up there? Yeah, it is a stupid level. Thank you for admitting that. Are you fucking kidding me? If I would have gone up there, I would have won. All right, I'm moving on. I deserve that victory. I literally had a choice to go up with the thwomp and I just didn't make that good choice. That was my clue right there. At, at that point, I already know I beat the level. The rest of the level is free. I shouldn't be playing this. It has naked pipes. <sighs> okay, so I can't lose my, my gotcha. Pretty cool level so far. Yeah, I could have cleared it. At that point, the fact that I saw I could have cleared it, I just like, I'm not interested in the level anymore. To me, I've cleared it in my mind. I already did the hard jump. I should have looked at more info before I actually played it at Endless. I would have just gone up there instead, but I don't like to spoil myself unless it's like a really hot garbage. Uh... What's over here? Nothing. If it's a hot garbage troll, then I look at more info, usually. Can I cheese this? But I don't think it matters. Yeah, it really didn't matter. I could have cheesed it, though, for sure. Oh, no, I guess you can't cheese it. Probably should not have gotten in there. Oh, it's reset. Okay. Oh, I shouldn't have gone in there. Oh, then God, I didn't get locked out. That would have just been bad. Only need one key, right? Pass is pretty cool. I like it. You only get one. Ch oh no, it's a reset. Never mind. I was like, you only get one chance for that. It's pretty lame. Uh, okay. Alright, sure. Someone really liked the, the concept of Shummit plus Snowball is win. I kind of like the concept too, though. I think it's pretty cool. I enjoy it. Oh, I should have used the other Snowball that I have there. There we go. No, oh, that's kind of lame. Okay, hold on. Before I do anything else. Okay, there's nothing up here. I just wanted to make sure. Where's my key? Is there any reason for the donut blocks? Peace switch wait time, probably. What? Okay.
I mean, fine. And just reset. And also grab an extra one for extra time. I think I should because there's a soft lock. This level has a checkpoint and a lot of soft locks. I don't like that. Oh. Oh, it's just a regular job. It, it still is a soft lock though, right? If you get stuck in there. But it's a checkpoint. I'm confused. Why would you have that in your level? Right? Soft lock? <laughs> Uh, that's not how you should design a level, my dude. I'm just saying. I kind of want to take a piece switch with me. Hold on. Might be cheese. Yeah, I noticed, starting to notice the, uh, the soft locks everywhere. But it's like, they had munchers on one. The piece switch store was kind of questionable. And that's when I started to realize this level, ugh, this whole soft lock concept. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have this on just to make sure. They're trying to... Why is there um? What? Okay, I'm just gonna use the one that I have. Yeah. I don't think I need the pal. Looks like I'm okay. I have the mushroom. I am super confused. Oh, this was for the piranha. Okay. Okay, they have a way back out. I kind of like that. That is better than what they gave me earlier. I should have been collecting coins. Oh look, second checkpoint. Can't wait to play it. Looks like a lot of fun. Why does it say why? Don't get it. It's lame, I hate it. Worst freaking fire flower section I've seen in a long time. I'm just gonna reset, because that's Probably what I should have done, because the cannon's gonna block me out. That's what they wanted you to do. I'm pretty sure the cannon just locks you out. Yeah, that's what it's designed for, it's just to lock you out. Yep, there it is, the lockout right there. I called it. Had a feeling. Interesting development there. Why was there a star? Yeah, that's probably what made it super expert was the soft flux, yeah. No one wanted to play it, and then the fire flyer became the hardest part of the level, so. I think AMM stands for all Mario Masters or like so I don't remember what it was. Yeah, I guess the start was just to be cool at the end. I've I understand that. Twelve seconds, huh? You know what? I'll take the clear. Made it. Hey, sunshine. Welcome to the stream. I'm doing fine. I'm about to get over 9,000 clears. I'm very excited for that. 10 more clears. Hey, replays is here too. Nice. Am I going for number one? Eh, eventually, as long as Celeste number one doesn't, uh, you know, go in overdrive and try to stay away from me taking over number one, then sure. Otherwise, I probably won't be able to get it. I shouldn't have touched this level, because I already lost. Oh my god, I thought I was dead. I mean, I probably am still dead with the timer. 
last. Why do people put piranhas at very random intervals in their levels like that? You know? It just seems kind of weird. Uh, what the f- Hello? No Z-Jump? Very surprised. Is it the door that wins? I knew it. I knew that would kill me. Uh, there's some weird crap at the end there. You see that? This will be my last chance, I think, on it. And I have to get out of here, probably. Well, I might do it one more time, because I think I can beat this level. As long as the door entry isn't really garbage, we'll be alright. I've never been a fan of one gap piranhas. They just don't feel right in this game. You know? There also might be another entry point in the back side of that, but whatever. Okay, that should be enough. Right? There's no extra wait time. Wow. This level is super tight. I gotta do an instant wall jump to win. Alright, one last try, I guess. One, one last good try and we move on. There really doesn't need to be sound effects there. I gotta do a really small wall jump here. That should be enough. If this doesn't give me the clear, I'm out. This should be enough time. Okay. Is that really a rad Mario? I thought that was like all Mario map. Well, record, I'll take it. Sure. Oh, I was trying to twirl, not Z-Jump. I can't see shit, come on. <laughs> what is this? Also, there's something to the left. Okay, so I need the right coins. What is this? Oh my god, I almost died. <laughs> oh god, I hate this. I think you actually have to do a triple jump here. What? Oh, there's no spring, I'm surprised. All right, get me out of here. I'll take it. I'm gonna boot for the sound effects. I think we really didn't need them in this level. The coin trail is garbage. Just can't see anything in this level. It is a loose timer though, I'll give it that. But that is not a fun speed run. They didn't make it for the last level. That's true, replace. A trade in a 10,000 treasure and everybody wins. 1,000 rupees for everyone in chat. Look at this garbage jump, man. Oh, thank you. Rip ball god, though. Wait, you gave 1,000 rupees to 219 users. That means, what? Essentially 219k in total that you just gave out. So, if anything, good job.
Well, you know what time it is. Time to make one-ups. You're welcome, guys. Yeah, I just... I, I looked at the percentage chance of getting the 1,000 rupees. It's 12% chance, I think, by the way. And I think getting 25k is 25% chance. And 50 viewers without a Twitch channel. Is that how many I have going on right now? Yeah, wow. I didn't even realize how many viewers I had. I never looked at them. All right. That's not what I wanted to do. I'm going to be honest. That's literally not what I planned. I should just jumped on it. I was trying to be cool and Z-jump. <sighs> it was my fault. I shouldn't have Z-jumped. I should have just jumped on them, got my 3 one ups and moved on. I regret it. I regret everything. I could have just used the shell to make reclaim one ups. I just realized. Hold on. Um... That's exactly what we're gonna do, unless there's auto scroll. Hold on. Is there auto scroll? No, there isn't. Okay. We're just gonna do it this way then. Not what I expected, but sure. You know what? Maybe I don't need all three, but we'll see. That's what I should have done instead of the bomb strap, but that's okay. Uh, I tried. Probably shouldn't have grabbed the checkpoint. I'm gonna go in one of the more ones, maybe. If I can. Oh, there's just so many red coins, dude. Let's go in the spiny section first. It seems like it might be the. Oh, this one. Wait, maybe this level might be okay. I don't want that mushroom. I guess I have to have it, though. Wait, I just realized. I could cheese this. I'm gonna have to take damage on purpose, though. There we go. Now I have this. Uh, they're gonna make me lose the mushroom, probably. I'm not sure, though. Oh, no. Well, now I don't have that, so rip. I guess I, I'll just damage boost. Hopefully I don't need it. Hopefully I don't need the... Do I need the mushroom? Don't kill me. Don't kill me for that. Oh, you don't kill me for that. I appreciate that. I might play this if they don't kill you like that. This is probably a... Now this is another awful section. I might die to him. There's a way to get a shellmate out of that, I think. Hold on. I don't know if this is going to work. This might get me killed. This is super risky. I've never done it on a slope before. It's not worth it. I'm just gonna stand on it. Uh, I should probably at least try to play where the level's telling me to do it, like right in the middle, probably. And then just duck. I'm assuming this is where I'm supposed to be standing. Never mind. Oh. What? I have to jump? Are you kidding me? I have to randomly jump? All right. Throw shellmits into one ways for cheese. I like your big brain, Zero, just so you know. The only one that's really hard to get is these two right here. We're gonna do we're gonna do your big brain strat. We're gonna do it. I like your big brain. It's funny, normally I see those kind of things. Not this time. Oh, I guess I can just do it twice. It's not a big deal. Yeah, I can just do it one more time now. Yeah. <laughs> 
This is super risky now. Hmm. Oh my god. How do you do that one? Do I just jump immediately? I need to I need to die instantly. I'm not I should have saved the coins. I don't know what I'm doing. I need to die instantly. This is worth it though. Uh not worth it for lives or worth it for time limit. Wise. I want to cheese this now very badly. And I have the lives to spend and it doesn't bother me. Did it again. Exact same thing I just did last time. That hurt my eyes a little bit. Holy crap. Alright, I think you want to I want to jump throw. The ones with the smaller bits. Yeah. That's what I want to do. I want to jump throughout the smaller ones. Damn it. Okay. I don't know how I want to do this. Uh. I have an idea. It's that it, it will require me to do one section. I know what section I want to do. Oh, I actually got to keep my shelmet. Nice. I messed up there too. Uh, we're gonna do it like this. I should have kept my. I should have went back for the red coins. Fuck. Okay. Well, now I have to do this first try. That kind of worked out. I'm gonna wait until... Hmm. Oh, I didn't hit the other one. I can still damage boost through this section, it's okay. Yeah, it's fine. We win. I could have gotten all of them, but it's fine. We should win. And I think it's a net neutral or maybe a minus one. Oh yeah, it definitely was worth it. Hello. Yoshi? Nice. And thank you, Zero, for uh, pointing that out because I smooth brained that one pretty hard. You really can't jump in on the 2x2 two two areas with the red coins, and that's exactly what this person did for the world record. You really can't jump in there, because the one moves will just suck you right in. Also, it's gonna show uh, sh Zero Planes uh, a tip with uh, making one-ups in Super Mario World. Just real quick. The world record literally could've... Yeah, it's fine. Not really... I I'll just use my current Unamaz to show you. I think in, I'll just do it in the subworld. We'll just extend this real quick. Play around with it. Okay. So, so I was talking to Zero about how you make one-ups in Super Mario World, how easy it really is. I'm going to show him how to do it. Here we go. You touched the... Any staircase part doesn't really matter. This doesn't work. You have to jump throw. See what I mean? It auto lines it up for you. It, if you just touch the wall, it will always be auto aligned. See what I mean? I don't know if there's anything else I can teach you. I mean, if you want to know what a staircase looks like, I, I've been teaching people about this. You just basically need this and the ice block is the block you need the shell to be on as long as you always have this setup you can literally just do this and get yourself an easy one up or so same as long as your setup looks like this you can get it and of course you know the whole wall one you can do the wall as well here we go so. How do I stop momentum precisely in Super Mario World SMB3 and SMB1? Uh, you just get good. 
<laughs> I have no advice for that other than just get good at it. I usually just turn around immediately, I guess is the best way to put it. So when I do that, I just turn around. I just like turn around constantly trying to get my momentum to go. Also, another tip you should know is that if you have a wall line up here, and do it like this. I mean, it's not really going to work here because it's going to kill you. But let's say you uh, don't have the room for it. And that you have like some weird setup that you could jump from. Here we go. If you can at least get your line up. Also, if you drop it from here like that, it works out really well for reclaim distance. See? So if you're like what if you're two blocks away, it's pretty easy to drop it on the go. Get a good reclaim spot. But if you uh, have a wall lineup, do something like this. I'm sure you already knew this though, but it's so nice to have a wall lineup for free. Yeah. You have to honestly just get good at stopping momentum. I just, whenever I see my momentum like moving away like that, I try to like adjust it on the fly. So yeah, otherwise you just like die. Here we go. If you have ground pounds, you can just so free. I guess if you practice it on a spin jump enemy. Let's see, where's the spiny? There it is. If you practice this on a, like it's your momentum on a spin jump. That's kind of like a good uh, practice point, honestly. So you can just like readjust your momentum like that. See, I'm like barely moving. I usually do like a left, right, right, left kind of instant snap to try to like get my momentum back. Yeah, I just do like a right left. If I'm moving to the left, I press right usually, I think. No. If I'm moving. Hard to explain. If I'm moving in a certain direction. Yeah, it's like a right left momentum. I push right to go further away from. So if I'm moving to left, I press right, but then I press left immediately to try to like counteract the speed I'm gonna go into. I guess that's the best way to put it. I don't know. It's. Don't play Trump Trump Bubbles. Don't do that. Uh, practice on the spin jump enemy. I think you'll do fine. Also, another big point, Zero. If you don't trust your momentum, hold jump on your reclaims. You can realign yourself really easily when you hold jump from a reclaim. I don't like the fact that this person says they're back. This is not a good sign. It's gonna be a big bump in encounter, isn't it? Something bullshit like that, isn't it? No? Oh my god. What in the world is this? I. There's no reason not to do this. I need a key? Where? Where does uh, Val get key? Where? At the beginning? Is it actually in the boss room? There's no way, right? Good thing you can't put keys in twisters, right? Dry bones you can't kill here. I feel like there's a key somewhere and I missed it. I'm gonna look for this key before I go in that room. Something doesn't seem right.
Well, at least I'm making it worth it now, huh? Okay, well, I got three one I'm said. I don't know how to deal with this room, though. Okay, at least I can stay down here, I guess. Oh, until this becomes a problem. That killed me? Also, I see the way out. It's right there. That freaking killed me. I thought it was the clown cover was going to hit it. <laughs> Do I have a 1-Up Farm uh, compilation? No, I don't. Also, high sugar. Um, morning, I guess, is the best way to put it. Wow. I don't think there's actually a key in any of those enemies. See you later. And to be honest, that Bullet Bill 1-Up Farm was literally on the spot. I didn't even know you could do that until today. 10 double shell jump practice. <sighs> Give it one shot, I guess. I gave it one shot. I think it was four in, maybe three in. I didn't like the setup that they did. It looks really ugly and it's hard to like, I don't know. They should have just stayed with. The best way to do a double show jump practice level is to only have one screen height, not two. Honestly, level to troll. Was four, okay, that's four in. I could have gotten more, but generally speaking, don't use more than one height. It's annoying. This is a bad idea. But maybe not. Maybe it's worth it. Oh, that is so tempting, but I need a key. Squished here, so can you please let me up? Thank you. Probably shouldn't have grabbed that checkpoint. I think the level would have been easier without it. Okay. This is probably the key, right? Okay, I don't know if I want that. Not nah, that mushroom is bullshit. Is that no you don't want you don't want the mushroom where, where is this claw hold on there it is can you even make this jump is that jump possible from there oh this jump looks just rose i think it is possible I don't have any interest in playing it again, though. I think I need to jump in the claw from the saw section to get the most speed out of it. I just didn't want to play it again. I really didn't. This isn't even worth it. Why did I even play this level? You're supposed to write the thwomp down? No, it's unless it was a... Uh... The only way that it could be possible is if the Thwomp was a parachute. Otherwise, it's not worth it.
Why is that up there? Hmm. Okay, well, you can't have the shell here. I gotta get rid of it. Oh, God. Okay, some of these rare coins are pointless. But I think they're required. Oh, well, I guess I'm not getting that 50. Bye-bye. <laughs> yeah, let me just not know where to go. Thank you. I appreciate that, actually. Oh, God. I didn't think the thump was going to come down and hit me like that. That worked out in my favor. Uh, I probably should have Zed. Oh, thank God, the level cares about you. I'm gonna do this on purpose. I don't know what the, they're gonna shoot. I, why is it just be suddenly becoming extreme Garbo? And I, oh God. <laughs> oh yeah, let's. Okay, at least I got that, I guess. But holy shit, this level is becoming stupid. How am I supposed to get that? Why, maybe? I need to have a full- oh my god, look. Ugh. What a Garbo level. Alright, let's do it again. You don't understand that mechanic? Which one? From the previous level? From the spin jumping on the thwomp or what? Also, I didn't realize there was another checkpoint. I forgot it was there. Shit, I'm dead again. <laughs> you know what? Let's go in the pipe at least and see if that was required. Oh, thank God. Get me out of here. What, the previous level, the mechanic with the... Was it the precision water level or the, the thwomp one? If it's a thwomp one, the mechanic for that thwomp... It's too, it's going down too fast. It's not even possible to read that. If they required that Z jump off of the thwomp that was going down really fast, that would be really hot garbo. It wouldn't be worth it. I don't think that creator even had the skill level to do that. Let's put it that way. Shouldn't touch this, but you know, the timer seems pretty nice. So I see why it's pretty nice. We gotta keep one. Nice. Let's go. So I need the red coins to come back through the blue pipe. What is this? And where do I start? Where do I even begin is the question. I want to say you begin yourself in the peace wish section, but I could be... I, well, if I can't do anything in the peace wish section, what am I supposed to be doing, you know? I think I'm dead, right? No, I'm not. Whoa, there's so much cheese here. What? Um, I have the key, so... Hold on. Oh, I have a shaman on. What am I doing? Is this literally an instant win? If so, how is this a super expert? It's not an instant win, but it might be the way to win. I... What am I doing? It doesn't like... It, it, doesn't, it really doesn't matter, as long as I can get the... In seconds, I don't think I'm gonna get it. It's gonna be really close if that's the case. It should be the end right here. I didn't get the top, but I'll take the. What's it? That was a plus one, right? I think it was. What a weird speed run. Team Shell, Casper level? That's gonna be a skip. Probably fun to play, though.
Wait. Pit a panga? Kinda? You mean you recreated a, a panga level? Oh, I feel about that. That is garbage. Moving on. We don't do that in the level. You just don't. That's just trolly. I mean, he spelled panga wrong, but. Oh, two in a row? I don't think he could have avoided that, honestly. Guess I need the mushroom. Up. Hello. Hello. Give me a second here. I'm trying to not die. I think this is a really hard level. Uh. Sanchez, thank you for three months of tier one. Hello to you too. This level's gonna kill me. I, I can already feel it. Seems like in. Seems like a pretty easy level with the mushrooms in place. But I could be wrong. Oh no, I already know where this is gonna go. It's gonna land me on top of the flop, right? Yep. Yeah, that's not even cheese, that just goes nowhere. It's starting to scare me. Bomb excavation out of nowhere, interesting. I don't know if I should be taking a, a bomb with me. Maybe I should. No, bomb was bad. I think the blue pipe. One up? I don't know one up. I might be required to beat the level though. Need the cat? No way. I refuse to believe. Did you actually need the cat? Ugh. That's kind of harsh, honestly. The level's been kind of fine until then. Oh, that's the whole level. I think it's a plus three? No. no. Plus one. I thought maybe there was enough enemies in the background. I saw four? I thought maybe there'd be five or six down below, but never mind. I think the reason why that wasn't super expert was because of the cat requirement. It was really hard. I thought it was kind of a good level, though, overall. You know, now that I think about, you know, just in general, I haven't seen too many 3D World levels today. That's like only recent. So, I guess I'm glad I at least... Oh, that's garbage. I guess I... <laughs> why, why would you put a Kaiser there? I guess I'm glad I got at least a couple of uh, fun 3D World levels, I guess, this entire stream. Is it all... So this, the whole line here, that's literally it. Gross. Oh, here too? Can you please mark them? God. I just got to zoom it now at this point. Wait, I can protect myself now. I have an idea, maybe? Actually, you know what? No, that's a bad idea. I had to go then and there. No, no, I didn't. I could have been more safe. Okay, I lost too many lives on this level because of hidden garbage. 
I think here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna play it smart. I'm gonna go as far as I can now. I think this is lame. This burner section is really stupid. I just deserve to die there, honestly. What? That's it? I'm disappointed. There's probably another one after the story. I can hear it. Yeah, well, fuck you, too. <laughs> oh, what? That is stupid. <laughs> that is so dumb. That fire bar shouldn't kill you. You should be able to reset. I should have gone faster there. That's my fault. Oh my god, I deserve to die there so hard. Okay, so for that section, I just gotta get good. I think it's an automatic procedure if I just don't fuck it up. I think if I just hold right, I shouldn't die to it. Maybe? I think that was... Oh yeah, see, I messed it up. I literally was fine. I just didn't know try to cheese it. George reset the timer, yeah. There's no global timer. If you reset with a pipe or a door, the fire bars and the burners reset as well. They placed it to kill you from the door if you try to reset it, which is garbage. They should have marked their Kaisos too. It's very close to a boom. I don't know if this is worth it. All right, here we go. Mm. I don't think so. With a level called Iron Maiden, I don't want anything to do with it. Hello, Black Aragorn. Now this looks like a good level. This is what you should be making for my contest. Light precision right here. Although maybe a little bit more piranhas, but that's okay. Oh, I messed up, but. Hold Aww. on. Zero planes cheered with 100 bits. It's under 9,000. Probably for the last time. I have to land on a freaking. Okay. Fine. That's lame. What do booze do? Uh, they lose maker points and you have a chance to not see it endless anymore. Uh, Zero, thank you, 100 bits. <laughs> it's under 9,000. It really is under 9,000, though. It really is. <sighs> Alright, I have a way to cheese this section. I gotta be really quickly about it, though. Ah, that's, that was my cheese right there, and I messed it up. Why is not that a black cannonball? Why did you ruin your level? This is gonna be my last chance, and I'm moving on. Oh, I cheesed it. Thank God. <laughs> That's that is just bullshit. I think I have to do this though. I can't die now. If I die, oh man. Do I need that, pal? You know what? I ref I forgive it. At the very least, they didn't screw me over there, you know? It could have been worse. Yeah, that was... They should have been black cannonball launchers. They should have been. Not red. Red is just dumb. Other than that, though, pretty cool level. 
All right, we're at 9,000, but it's not over 9,000 yet. We got to get one more clear and then we're done. I know, a THX. They didn't write like or ask for like, so I don't, I'm not going to boo it. There's no reason to. This is such a lame 9001 level, right? I'm just going to skip it. Right? I think that's just a lame level to get. This might be a fun level. Well, not if you mess it up. I mean, the music, the speed, kind of resembles a, you know, a really go fast level kind of thing. Or dealio. And what I'm trying to say is, it, it's pretty fun so far. You can get crushed there, by the way. And I'm not even fast enough. Not even close to being over 9,000 rip. I'll get it, though. This one seems doable. I ran on the water, you see that? That was actually a bad idea. What? No, throw it. <laughs> what am I doing? Just throw it. Okay, just toss it immediately, I think. No. That's such a good thumbnail, too. I have to go that fast with this level? Ridiculous. so slow i'm holding run and i'm oh i'm getting screwed i might have enough time i doubt it though that might be enough time one second might be enough yes we got it let's go I knew someone would do that. I knew somebody would use that on over 9,000 clears. Uh, you know, for a speedrun, <laughs> two of them? <laughs> you guys are insane. <laughs> Honestly, not a bad level. Uh, the required frog speed tech is kind of lame, though. It's over 9,000! <laughs> I, I, I don't think in good conscience I can play those ads because we're going to go raid somebody. But I will make up for that in due time. Don't worry. Uh, it was for the meme anyways.